All right. Let's switch over our title. Deadfall Tropics. Jesus Christ. All right. Okay, what do we got here? Are you do are you being dumb? Change that. Okay. Title has been changed over. Thank you and gracias. So, up next on our first 30 minutes gaming review showcase, we have Safe Climbing. Turn the music down a little bit. Sounds really good. Difficulty is just automatically set to Nightmare. jump i want it to be b use can be x throw can be a just don't mess with my controller don't tell me it's different buttons start a new game don't climb the mountain be the mountain Oh, I'm being timed to the top. <laughs> I got split in twain to the top. Oh, there we go. So there's no run. <sighs> Just gotta give her. Just gotta hoof it. Okay. So you have to let that fall first, I'm guessing. <clears throat> oh my god. <laughs> so this. I'm enjoying based on the fact that it's just, it's doing exactly what it's supposed to be doing. Like this straight up is just a frustration platformer at its purest. The other game was meant to be a retro platformer, but it is frustrating. So we gotta just, is this gonna be another one? <laughs> Why did that? happen there's no run button so I'm just gonna I may hit a record of a hundred deaths in two games on one 30 minutes session here this is something else I want to use that. How do I get it? <laughs> it just so like gently squishes into the base of my skull. Safe climbing. This is ridiculous. Okay, come on. What? <laughs> I, I'm at a loss for words. Uh, so, now here's the funny thing. I can say a lot of the same things that I was just saying about Deadfall Tropics, but I'm saying them with a smile in this game. So that might tell you a bit. Why would that happen? Why would that ever happen? 
Just run, boy. Okay. So uh, you you have to get close enough for this to just go, go. Jesus. Can I use your hat? Like, does the spider have anything to do with it? I jumped. <laughs> okay. To the top. Okay. This is obscene. Like the jumping. You feel, again, you feel the weight of the jumping. You're not going to jump very far. You're going to always, like, feel like you need to be... How do you get... How do you get away from that? Am I supposed to get that? Like, am, do I pick it up? Instead of having it kill me? Like... What am I... Back to flag? No. Okay. What? Uh, okay. Mm, run, 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 run. This really is something very magical. <laughs> okay. mm, mm. No. How do you get past that? Am I supposed to pick it up? Like... I'm trying to press buttons, and I keep getting stabbed in my head. So, why is throw? Oh, right. The stalactite. Am I supposed to juggle it? <laughs> like, can't really tell. Ugh, go. <laughs> now we've got it. Press Y to use the pick. <laughs> this game is just one big beginner's trap. But you're learning through doing it. Like, it's like every single thing. The nearest thing I can think of is like Dragon's Lair, except like I'm enjoying myself. What? Oops, sorry. It told me to throw it. And I died. And said, oops, sorry. So, in case you were wondering what kind of game we're playing here today. Safe climbing. <laughs> okay, don't press A to throw the pick. <laughs> I got... I got out of the way, but not out of the way enough. You gotta learn to die before you can run, right? That's how the saying goes. You gotta you gotta die 37 times before you can run. Huh? Okay. Alright. Someone's taking pictures. <laughs> my body came off of my shins. So, the frustration level of the game is is done in such a way that it's, like, properly taunting you. 
Like, you know that you can do better than what is happening to you. They've crafted it to be unfair. You're going to die several times on each obstacle just trying to do them the first time or even just that. This is so ridiculous. But contrary to how I felt during Deadfall Tropics, I am enjoying myself. I'm getting very frustrated, but like, I have a smile on my face. It's like making me laugh and, and it's taunting you in the fun way. It's not just like, this is stupid. The controls are bad, like, fuck you. Okay. all you got. <sighs> so. <laughs> just gotta, just gotta, what? There are, oh, so there's environmental traps like springs and platforms that will smush you. I cannot believe this. I mean, they really should call this fuck you the game. Ah, fuck you. Ah, you, you paid money for this? You fucking idiot. Alright. So we gotta climb all the way up. So that we can let go. Leap! of faith <laughs> you died you died how like life <laughs> how like life is this climb up the mountain you can you can do everything right <laughs> and still get cleaved in twain by a falling rock Alright, I'm going to see what's up that next peak, because I just got to know now. Yeah, you thought you had me, you stupid idiot. Okay. Let's go. Climb, brother, climb! Have a safe climb. I'm not sure, I'm not even sure where that thing is. I died because I'm scared of getting hit by it again. Okay. Yes, sir. Oh. This is just... We really lucked out on the draw on the games for today. I gotta tell you, this is something really special. Two dangerously cheesy frustration games. <laughs> I'm gonna need a refill on my medication here. Okay. Can I talk to you? That, there's not even an indication of that. You just have to know. Like, I didn't even see that coming. This is mental. Well, thanks a lot getting over it with Bennett Foddy. You've just, you've helped unleash a whole type of hell. Games that really are just like, yeah, well, you know, you can do it if you want. 
suggesting that somehow it's like it's your lack of sheer will. Oh, so down just takes you right off. You can't climb down, I don't think. I'll try when we get to the next. Nope. I'll try when we get to the next climbing section. Let's safely try to climb down and see if that's a possibility. But I don't know that it is. I don't think it is. Jesus. Really? Okay. So you can only climb up. You can only climb up. This is so mental. <laughs> I'm... I'm astounded. I truly am. What do we got here? Oh, yeah. Can't you take his hat? like suggesting that Indiana Jones also died in the first chamber here. Okay. No. Ah. Like I don't want to I don't want to press the down button, but I'm also like how do I get away from this impending doom trap? that I know is coming. It's right there. It wants me dead. <laughs> Mama told us there'd be days like these. Climb, climb. Hey. Instant. I wonder if I have to use that to like launch myself over to the other side. Cause I don't know if like I could count the rocks, you know, and be like, oh, that's the one that triggers it. But like, do I even have enough clearance to jump across at that point? That's the one. <laughs> These games are about, um, Cramming a sense of stoicism down your throat, I think. <laughs> All right. Use that pick. Let's jump some rocks. 15 minutes. That's fun. <laughs> Still very much in the beginning of the game. All right. Up we go just annihilated. It really makes you wonder, like, what's next? I think that's the addictiveness of this gameplay loop. Like, it's taunting you. The carrot and stick. And the carrot is, like, worse than an unsauced carrot. Because, like, like, what even is there? We Probably more pain, you know? It's like, not a carrot on the stick, it's like a punch in the face on the stick. Like, oh, maybe this other punch in the face will feel a little bit better than the last one. Okay. And now, like, it's, you know, 
stopped starting to speed up. Because I've been through this so many times, I don't want to see it anymore. Get out of it. Okay. Mm -hmm. So what's our, like, what's our clearance here? Let's find out. Okay. I die. If I miss it, I die. So, like, there's no... And you can't get any momentum coming off the wall. You literally just have to, like, let go of the wall and fall diagonal. And hope that you climbed far enough to get it. No! My s beautiful skull! My blood! Oh, I needed it inside me. Not everywhere else. Okay. Thank you very much, Mr. Rock. <laughs> Charging head first. I'll beat those rocks with sheer determination. No! Okay. We're gonna get this all sorted out, Billy. Run away. All right. I want to know who the fuck this idiot is. Taking pictures. Oh! Lord. Am I supposed to use it to go the other... Like, I feel like I've died so many times trying to get onto the other wall from that spring, but... Like, maybe I'm supposed to be using it to my advantage. <laughs> or maybe I'm doomed to eternally be cloven in twain by a falling rock. <laughs> this is my Sisyphean feat. It doesn't get any less painful. No! Oh, I really needed not to be poked with holes today. I had things to do and friends to meet. Yeah, that's what I thought. Nope. Okay. Jesus. We're gonna get up this goddamn wall. You're locked in. You are locked in. At the second you get on that thing, you're, you're toast. Like, it, it locks you into the animation, and you are dead. I don't know how you're supposed to get past that. <laughs> yeah, I died. I definitely did. Could I be any more of a squish? Okay. Mm, yes. Yep. Run away. Hurl yourself up the mountainside. So it looks like he's like ready, readying himself for it. <laughs> uh, like you can't even, it's difficult to get yourself back on to 
the wall, so I'm still not even sure that this is what I need to be doing. <laughs> is that one, one toe over the pixel? Nope! I couldn't get off the wall in time. This is something special. This game has just woven itself into my brainstem. Okay. <laughs> like, it, it really is just teasing you. This <laughs> is being really mean to you. Get up there, Brad Climerson. dead. I didn't even mean to do that. I just was trying to see like if I could get a little bit extra oomph on the jump, but I think it's just an animation to get you psyched up for the jump that you have to make. Okay, don't throw the pick. <laughs> yeah. Oh, whoa! Hey! Hey now! I didn't press that button. I pressed one of the shoulder buttons. Is that something? There's like a button for leaping off walls. It didn't even do anything extra. He was just falling. It just falls so fast that it's like comical. And then the fact that the pickaxe just falls so slow and buries itself so deep into your skull. Okay. It really is just like B or down, and then you're off to the races. What am I supposed to do? Maybe I gotta throw my axe up there. Let's, let's find out about that. Like, it seems like you can use that to trigger traps, right? Like, that would be a useful way to get up here, if that actually works. If not, then I'm just gonna grab the nearest screwdriver and jam it into my temple. <laughs> just easier than enduring this. Can I... <sighs> okay. I mean, only 56 deaths in 23 minutes. That's not... <laughs> That's not so bad. <laughs> Compared to other games we've played today. Alright, 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 alright. Let's just... So we need a lot of leeway to be able to... I can't even get... It's instant. It is instant. So I don't... I Maybe I have to jump over the spring fall onto it, and then have it launch me up. Ugh. Oh, except that happens, because I'm not paying attention. Because I'm just so... Uh, I guess the word you could use is flummoxed. <laughs> if you were so inclined. 
Jesus Lord. Okay. Yo! Choopy 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 choo! Alright. I'm gonna jump over. I'm gonna almost get murdered. Oh! He just leaps off! Okay, so maybe if I just push the down button, he'll let go. And then I'll fall straight down onto the trampoline, and I can use that to go to the other side. Clear this. Fucking hellhole. <laughs> this is just... This is absurd. If I can make it to at least like the next checkpoint flag, I would be so happy. I don't think I will. One, like one more up and I'll be toast. So the trampoline doesn't come out. Maybe what I need to do is jump over the trampoline then be facing the other way. <laughs> oh. You just took the knife and you twisted it. Okay. <laughs> Why? We got this. One pixel. Uh, why can't I trigger this anymore? I'm gonna get up there, and there's gonna be another imperceptible trap. I'm just gonna walk right onto it, and it's gonna screw me over. And I'm gonna cry on the internet for all to see for all time. Okay. All right, John Clymerman. This is a test. And you've passed. Now there's gonna be another one, isn't there? Yeah. How many? That one's dripping, so that one's also going to fall, right? That was different. <laughs> but we solved the riddle of the bouncy platform. <laughs> Every time. Like, it falls comedically fast. Ugh. All right. Got a little under. Ugh. So our timer says we're coming up on 30 minutes. I do want to see what happens when we get outside. So this will probably be the last attempt. One. Okay. Run away. Pick that up. Don't get crushed by rocks. Because it's bad for your bones. More so than osteoporosis. Okay. All right. Uh, 
I just... Like the... So do we have to run out of the way of it? Do we need to knock it over? Oh, those are spooky eyes. I just noticed that for the first time. Okay. Come back. Pick that up. The game has its hooks in me, despite the fact that this is like unbelievably stupidly frustrating. It it really is making you like want to keep trying. And there's nothing in it for me, like So I'm just gonna jump out of the way. Yeah. Nice try, idiot. Okay, he's barely holding that rock up. Oh my god! That was the flag. And there's a duck? I'm gonna get to that flag. And then I'm gonna save my progress. So that if I ever, you know, get bored of sticking nails in my eyes, I can just come back to this. And know the sweet release. I just wanted to feel out of control of my life. <laughs> okay. Up we go. Fun, fun, fun till daddy took the T-bird away. How? I'm getting to that second flag. So maybe the sign of a good frustration platformer is that it makes you feel personally attacked? I suppose. Um, if you make it go from like, oh yeah, this is a fun game, to like, I feel like this game is insulting my entire family and I won't be able to face them again unless I make progress in it. I think that that is just... It's a feat. Like, it's not an easy thing to pull off. I don't like that. And I don't know how to trigger it in a way that it'll come out and not catch me. Ooh, too soon. <sighs> okay. We're gonna get up these boulders. We're gonna find a new purpose. And we're gonna get to that goddamn flag. I don't know why I was able to get past the falling rocks there the other times. Because now I'm doing the exact same thing and I can't seem to do it. So... I mean, that could be a problem. If I have to just stop and then start, like, from the same checkpoint. <sighs> what a mess. Okay. We're gonna do it, and we're gonna finish strong. Go, having fun, having fun, putting ourselves in immediate danger, scaling rock walls with the deafness of an Alpen Swiss countryman, breathing freely of the mountain air devoid of all oxygen, and yet somehow full of hope. I jumped. Can you run any faster, Craig? Uh, no, <laughs> apparently not. <laughs> Incredible. So my frustration levels are peaking. I'm good. This is the last attempt, regardless. 
if I make it or not. I just have to move on to something else. I love how it tells you to throw the pickaxe and then it's like, oops, lol, you're dead. Don't throw it. <laughs> yep. Okay. okay. Yep. See you later, traps. Have a nice life. So we just run. The whole thing goes. The whole thing goes. I'm doing it. That was so... That was stolen from my fingertips. You can check. I bet it took a couple of my fingernails with it. You guys going to play outside? Remember to get your mitts. Just warm. Yes, your mitts. On the couch. They better be, because that's where we left them. I remember you throwing them back on the floor. This fucking duck. What is this? What is this? It impaled me. It ma it matches you. It You know what? Let's just leave it at that because that perfectly summarizes this game. You take three steps, and you get impaled by a mallard. Um, so, this game is frustrating as all balls. Uh, however, it's done so in a clever way that actually makes you want to keep playing. I could not say that about the previous game. Uh, this is great. It's very simple. Um, it it again. It leans into the limitations. It's designed to hurt your feelings. Like it's going to make you angry and frustrated, but uh, in a way that again challenges you. The next carrot is just right above your head, and you're like, okay, I can figure this out. Uh, yeah, this this game's hilarious. And you'll be laughing every time you make a mistake while you're also, like, you know, crying. Drowning yourself in a pool of tears. But, uh, fantastic game. It's pretty fucking ridiculous. Um. So that... That was our first 30 minutes. I'll throw on the BRB there. That was our first 30 minutes showcase for today. We certainly played some games today. Holy shit. Um, these were really ridiculous. Uh, some good ones. Some okay ones. Some not so good. But uh, overall enjoyable. And I'm glad that we're flying through all these games at the speed of sound um i don't think i'll be able to get another stream in tonight but uh hopefully we can get into a bit more of a regular flow as the days goes on the days goes on anyways that's it for me thanks for hanging out past present and future here at the lazy shell and we'll catch you around.